Hi, I'm Saveri from Hornet Plugins and today I would like to show you a trick that you can do with a new LU meter that may help you uh, to get the right uh, loudness of the tracks you need to send to various distribution systems like uh, YouTube uh, or Apple Music and iTunes uh, or Spotify or whatever. And every one of the system normalizes the audio to a certain uh, loudness amount specified in uh, LUFS. Um, for example, YouTube uh, usually uh, normalizes everything to uh, negative 13 uh, LUFS. So if your tracks um, are going to sound good at, on YouTube, they will, you need to uh, listen to them uh, at that level and make sure that you're not compressing too much or, uh, or having an issue uh, because you have peaks that are going to clip if you normalize them at that level. Um, with the new LU meta, you can uh, uh, normalize your track to the, one of these uh, references and uh, uh, pre-listen if uh, this, the track is going to sound good on those systems. Um, it's a pretty simple and uh, it can be done with a new long-term normalization feature. So uh, let's dig into a small session I did to demonstrate uh, this uh, feature and I'll show you how it works. So here is the new LU meter. You have uh, here the new long-term uh, normalization option. I've made this small session, it's just a, a house loop and uh, I will pretend this is a complete track, of course it's not, but uh, for the sake of this video it'll work. So um, I'll press play now with the LU meter, uh, non-active, non it's a, a 0 dB the gain here and I have the peak protection and everything is uh, in its default just as I have just put it on the track. It's of course on the master bus because I want to normalize the whole, the whole song to uh, the specified level. So, uh, let's see how first the track sounds. So, uh, what we want to do is uh, to set this little thing here to normalize uh, everything to uh, the YouTube level uh, that it's minus 13 dBs. I've put it that in my reference so that when the meter peaks here we are at minus 13. So uh, what I want to do is to disable the max peak protection because I want to allow peaks to clip uh, because I want to know uh, if my peaks are going to clip at this level so I don't want any kind of protection and uh, I will normalize to 0 LU so this level here with the long term press play now and uh, the gain will adjust to reach this level in average pretty simple. Uh, the software has determined that uh, we have to apply 8.8 .8 dBs of gain to uh, this loop to have it stay at minus 13 LUFS integrated so for, from the beginning of the measurement to the end and uh, this is already ready to be exported and ready for the YouTube loudness. If I wanted to target, for instance, iTunes uh, or Apple Music, whatever, for what it matters, I would have to put here 16 and start the um, analysis again. Okay, and now uh, I, if I export the, the, the mix down from, from live, it will be at minus uh, 16 at a UFS uh, integrated level. Um, 
it's this tool is also useful to uh, listen and to know if the track would sound good at this level. This track is not too squashed, but probably is too much because we are never reaching uh, any level close here. Um, this is because we have probably have compressed or uh, cut off the peaks too much with this plugin or other limiter in the mix. And uh, we are sacrificing uh, the dynamic range of the track for more loudness. But this uh, may have a different impact on different platforms. So you have to judge if uh, this is good for what you're doing, for what you want to achieve or not. And that's it. It's pretty easy. Uh, for regarding the references I've used here, I found them on the internet. You just have to search for them, search in uh, LFUFS uh, reference levels or YouTube levels or uh, something like that. You will come out with uh, different results and a uh, handful of tables that shows you the differences between services. So, um, LU Mater is available on HornetPlugins.com and you can download it uh, from our website. There is no demo for this plugin, but we offer a 100% money back guarantee if you don't like it. So you feel free to try it out and uh, let us know uh, if you have suggestions or other questions, feel free to write us. Thank you very much for watching.